गुड मॉर्निंग डॉक्टर उत्तम हियर गुड मॉर्निंग नमस्कार सर जी नमस्कार नमस्कार आपसे मुलाकात हुई आपकी दोस्त राजी कौन राजन साहब नहीं बात होती है मुलाकात तो नहीं हुई आई नो आई नो आप बेंगलोर में कहा हो डॉक्टर बेंगलोर में मलेश्वर में हो मलेश्वर जी ओके वर्ल्ड ट्रेड सेंटर उसकी बाजी में ओके आई बी कमिंग देयर नेक्स्ट मंथ Oh good cool please be our guest sure sure i will uh, i will message you uh, sure sure definitely <clears throat> doctor my friend suchi will also be coming next month from australia so we are going to oh. visit you i am going to bring her and come sure, to sure 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 <laughs> suchi if you are here <clears throat> i'd love to do that kita <laughs> anand We we'll, we we'll come and see you, Doctor Bala. Sure, sure, sure. <clears throat> Let us know when to start. It's seven o two, Doctor. You can start seven o two. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. That's right. It's better. ओम गुरु भ्यो नम यू कैन सी मई स्लाइड्स शेल आई मेक इट बिगर नो डॉक्टर इट्स फाइन इट्स फाइन ओके वी कैन स्टार्ट गुरु भ्यो नम यस मैडम गीत एक शार्ट यूनिवर्सल नो प्रॉब्लम और कन्नन आई कुड स्टार्ट वेरियस प्लैनेट्स वेरियस प्लैनेट्स इन डिफरेंट भावास या ओके नो वी आर अगेन रिपीटिंग भावास एंड द जोडियक साइंस आर टू डिफरेंट थिंग्स आई एम जस्ट रिपीटिंग जस्ट फॉर रिफ्रेशिंग This is lagna, where ascendant is written, or in the traditional chart it is written like this diagonal. They put a diagonal. That means it's a lagna. That is where one, two, three, four, five, bhavas. Bhavas means the the place, the house. Okay. So now, for this gentleman, we are talking today. We are talking about Mars. Continue. Other Sanskrit names: Mangala, Kuja, representation, weapons, arms, surgery, defense, military, police, martial arts. All these come under his domain. Fiery temperament and skill in war are the prerogatives of Mars. In other words, Mars represents action. It's like a engine. I always call Lagna is a chassis, Moon is the driver. uh uh sun is the battery and the mars is the engine i'm just giving a crude example but just to give an idea action it is a action oriented uh when mars is strong person is very action aggressive sportive etc when mars is weak less sportive less aggressive etc etc so that's how we should remember okay Mars in first house, Bhava. The first represents the core of who we are, persona, self, image, and innate personality. Bold and courageous, aggressive and adventurous, anger prone and fiery, prone to injuries, illness related to head and eyes, cerebral, <coughs> meningeal and skull, wound and scar on head or body, health, blood disorders and surgical interventions. these are all probabilities and huh? don't worry <clears throat> uh, mars in first term everybody has to blood the uh, disorder surgery nothing like that it is just a probabilities 
is not a futurology or predictology or predictions. Please, we are just trying prone for kind of thing. Okay. Right. Who has got Mars in the first house? Uh, Dr. Lakshmi here. Good morning. Okay. Good morning. Uh, this morning. is uh, for my husband and my second daughter. <laughs> Okay. I checked yesterday, it almost matches everything, I think. That is what we were worried when uh, I read wound and scar on the head. In fact, my younger one daughter, she has a wound on the, this one she had hurt when she was young. Yeah, so there are pictures there, the so she was showing. Scar, yeah. Yeah, scar was there. But uh, blood disorder and surgical means, I mean, probability that it might occur sometime? Not necessary, ma. don't worry. It is possible. Latent thing, don't that's what I was trying to tell you. It's mm -hmm. why it is said in the Bharajatka, it is said, but we are just uh, trying to keep it as a thing, not necessarily that all the Mars Malagnas are blood disorder. Mm. Okay. The, uh, connection with the health aspect is the blood disorder, that's all. Okay, related, not uh, not to worry. That's what my point. Okay, doctor. okay. So these people are more, uh, even while uh, cutting vegetables, small, small bleeding can happen. This kind of a thing. They're very really prone. Uh, to prone to small injuries, yeah. Uh, small, you know, falling from, from the staircase. You would have seen from childhood, staircase falling down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This kind of a thing, slipping in the bathroom, kind of. There is a common thing for okay. them. They are very aggressive and adventurous. That's Both are correct. <laughs> and uh, the basically... Uh, uh, in their life, they are like a Jhansi Rani Lakshmi Bhai or Kittu Rani Channamma or whatever you call. Mm. So that's their life. They are bold and really they face the world like anything. That's the basic thing. Okay? Yeah. Okay, doctor. These are all uh, injuries, just an uh, indication as all. Well. Nothing to worry. Okay. Thank you, doctor. Naturally, when a person goes to war, he is bound to get some injuries, is he? Yeah. Are... So that's the indication of those days. <laughs> Not necessary if this era. Okay. Thank you. If you Mars, in his... ah, yeah. Second. Mars in second house, Bhava. The second represents the liquid assets, speech, family, food, and nourishment. Rude and crude, straightforward, heartless, merciless, misguided in life hoards wealth, luck in all spheres, argues well, hence proves to be a good lawyer. Yeah. Uh, this is all appears. Okay. Appears. This is an appears. Oh, yeah. This actually appears rude and crude, straightforward, etc. Not, not that they are uh, rude and crude. And uh, it's written in the sloka uh, uh, Dviti uh, Mangala Sputa Vagdat Renama. Sputa Vagdat, but look, they are like explosive. They, uh, when they talk, it appears to the opponent, opponent or person who is sitting behind or sitting in front of him or her. It appears, oh my God, what is this? This uh, gentleman or lady talking like this, this kind of thing. It's not like that. They are very, uh, even if they are calm, example, even if, uh, example, me taking my chart as second, if I say, Gita, man, Gita madam, please come for coffee. But by the time it goes to your ear, it looks like, Gita madam, come for coffee. <laughs> That kind of a thing. It's like an explosive. And they won't know that it is explosive for them. They will be talking like that only. Oh, do this one or do this. From them, they are thinking that they're very polite and they're talking like that. That is the point. You should see them in reality. That's what I said. Who has got second in the mass? Hello? Anybody? March second house. Okay, we'll go for the third. Mars in third house, Bhava. The third represents aim, ambition, courage, art, passion, communication. 
people living and working nearby. Ambitious, bold and courageous, well-built and nourished personalities. Adventure is a way of life. Luck favors good support from his brothers and friends. However, it is detrimental to the younger brother, not sister. Uh, this is what one of the reason. Either they don't have younger brother, or even if they are, they are they'll be far away or kind of a thing. It is just said in the Shastra, but Jatka, it said it's not very comfortable for younger brother. If they are, I would always suggest the clients. I would tell tell them, for example, like in a, a house, I prefer to. Uh, separate them in a different bedroom. Example, I'm just saying they are small kids. I said either, and I, if there is an opportunity of sending one boy to the hospital, try to do that. This is what practically I've seen. Very important point. Uh, 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 lots of, uh, anyway, this is just for your information. Anybody has got a mask in the third house? My son has Dr. Gita here. My son has Mars in the third house. Luckily, no younger brother, but... Ah, that's it. That's fine. <laughs> then there's no question about any... Generally, son and Mars in the third house, generally, they are the last batsman in the house. They don't have younger siblings. Younger brothers or siblings, generally. Okay. Anybody? Yes, sir. Third? Good morning, Dr. Vintage here. Uh, good morning. Good morning. Third house. Oh. Third house. Oh, you... <laughs> <laughs> you send Rajesh out. I told you, you should send him to Africa. Yes, sir. He is planning now. You're telling, uh, pass the sea, you told him. Ah. Dhanur Lagna, right? <coughs> uh, which one, sir? Your younger brother, Rajesh, Varsha Lagna or Dhanur Lagna? Oh, that I, I don't know, sir. I don't remember. Sorry, sir. No, that's okay, okay. He's not in the class today? No, actually, he's unable to join, sir. Uh, no worries, no worries. Yeah. You better send him fast. Okay, sir. As far as possible. That's better. Okay, okay sir. Thank you. Mars in fourth house, Bhava. The fourth house represents our interest and ability to know in nurturing others and building a social environment. Weak position for Mars, dissatisfaction home front, constant desire for achieving peace and harmony, inability to compromise, lack of support from mother's side, well respected outside the house. There is one thing I have to add here. Mars in This and this. Okay, this is the one thing we should remember. Mars in the fourth house or missing the first phenomena is a common thing. Hello? Yes, doctor, we can hear you. Yeah. Missing the phenomena in the fourth house, as well as in the cancer. This is one thing we should not forget. What we counsel the people are, uh, never miss an opportunity. It's called as in call. I think last time I said in the, when Mars is in the cancer and fourth house is the same thing, very similar. People do, do not realize the opportunity when they get, and then later they realize, oh my God, I should have done this. Oh my God, I should have gone. Oh my God, I should have applied. This kind of thing. So, we have to educate the clients. We have to educate them. It's a kind of a divine call, which we do not realize the importance at that particular time. Example, somebody calls you. Example, somebody calls you from a uh, close friend from Tanzania. And he says, uh, hey, uh, hey, my friend, uh, would you like to come? My neighbors, father-in-laws, sister-in-laws, uh, brothers, uh, uh, son's wedding is there. Who will come, you know? This is the kind of, you know, I'm just giving a crude example. 
some kind of sometimes you know we logically and intellectually say hey, come on man your neighbor your father his father in law his sister in law somewhere in this thing and why should i come this kind of a thing we don't realize i'm just giving a good example so this is very important point mars fourth house mars in the cancer please 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 their action has to be very proactive and has to act up upon getting it <coughs> that's why i call that as a missing the bus phenomena once they miss they later on realize okay anybody in the fourth shall we continue doctor yeah please mars in the fifth house bhava the fifth house represents creativity intellect children amusement speculations and childlike activities luck with speculation hyper acidity in digestion high risk pregnancies and females trauma or injury during childhood charismatic and beauty this is very plain no problem at all okay and generally with the fifth house mars are very aggressive in their professional interaction risk taking scenario and they are bungee jumpers example i'm not bungee jumper means this is they are very daring people anybody in the fifth doctor uh, moshankar here mine is uh, yeah tell me moshankar i think uh, uh, luck with speculation uh, and i think hyper uh, acidity or indigestion those two definitely are matching very well <laughs> <laughs> naturally pregnancy cannot match <laughs> yes <laughs> yeah i don't remember any trauma or injury but no 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 uh, that's okay that's, that's just generally in the childhood uh, some of the fall heel small thing you know it's a, uh we I mean, just generally always 11 months first 11 months is the initially anything has to happen first 11 months is the thing don't worry about it so uh, first two definitely matches especially the first one in stock market <laughs> yeah that that's a inborn quality god has given okay so people who don't use we encourage them to do it not only necessary stock anything connected with uh, speculation for example somebody comes and advises uma shankar hey why the uh, why don't you buy there is one uh, uh, piece of land beautiful in haryana uh, my god who will go to haryana somebody so kind of a thing if they take risk it will happen that is my example something very unusual they are very lucky doctor yeah, um, my children both my children shriniketh and shrinidhi yeah so that's why they are good and uh shriniketh is in seventh house and ninth house uh, like a dance like a action that's also will be there ninth also mars okay we'll see anyway they are very lucky very bold except she the the first pregnancy always is to be careful that's all okay i'm not trying to scare i'm mm. just to give a precaution that's all nothing to worry yeah any okay fifth mars and fifth sun both are in the female chart high risk it means not to neglect during the first uh, uh, second three prenatal period that's all okay Shrinidhi is the seventh house. Oh, sorry, sorry. Anything? No, no, no. Uh, doctor, this is Kannan. Uh, Shrinidhi, uh. yes, she has problem with her digestive system always. When uh. It's always there. Yeah, Shrinidhi is in the seventh house, Sunita. No, no. It is not. Lagnat land is here, but uh, house on the Simhat land are kitche ba. No, but we are talking about Lagna from Lagna. Baba is from Lagna. No, that's it. I know that, but it is in the Simba. Okay, okay. okay let's, let's discuss later. Yeah. No, no, no. You don't consider it as a fifth house. It's just a secondary that is. But just this is just from Lagna. More importantly, Lagna. Okay. Sixth house. Mars in sixth house, Bhava. The sixth house represents how we move. from self protection to protecting others and advancing others sound physique and good health 
success in competition, gains from friends, hospitality and healthcare industry, fourth aspect, technical sports, eighth aspect, adventurous. This is uh, very unique, uh, people do realize. And uh, anybody in the mass in sixth house? Roga Runa Nipu. Sixth house represents Roga Runa Nipu. Okay. Shrifti here, doctor. I have it yeah. in sixth house along with uh, Shukra. Okay. Wow. Mars and Venus, Shukra is a very... I'll, I'll tell you the combination later on. Okay. But does it match anything? Uh, yeah, a little. What Not industry me. are you working for? I'm uh, I'm a content writer. Content writer. Artist. Yeah. But anything connected with health and hospitality or design, something like that? No. No. Okay. Time yeah, hospitality, if I consider, we have many guests always visiting our house 365 days. Ah, so that, that I can consider. That's exactly. That's what I said. Hospital yeah. healthcare does not mean one has to be a doctor, nurse, and uh, hotel. It mm. can be primary school teacher. Primary school teacher, yeah. her hospitality would be caring for the kids. Mm. Auto rickshaw driver, uh, mm -hmm. you, he would uh, take the bag of the clients and help him to get an exam example. See, mm -hmm. don't think that healthcare, hospital admins has to be doctor, nurse, and a hotelier. Okay. Yeah. It, the art of hospitality, art of healthcare, see, uh, uh, even a driver, he sees a person limping for his clients. He'll say, he would say, this, Doc, uh, Sir, why don't you do this one? Why don't you do this? Kind of, he may, he may suggest a hospital, he may suggest a doctor, he may suggest a medicine. Something yeah. doesn't mean one has to be a doctor. Yeah. Example. Yeah. It can be anything in the world. Mm -hmm. uh, what is this fourth aspect and eighth aspect? I will talk about the aspects later on. I will not talk actually. Every planet okay. does. I, I think last time I sent somewhere. Okay, I'll show, show you. Okay. Did I send in the... Uh, I will not talk about this class. No worries. Mars in the seventh house, Baba. Uh, seventh represents the person opposite, not opposing to you. How you interact, how you deal, etc. Can be your spouse, partner, boss, client, customer, etc. Misunderstandings galore, argumentative and conf confrontational, hot temperedness, never as frontline officer or negotiator or marketing, prosperous outside the country, possibilities of business or marital relationships prove better only away from motherland. This is one thing why I have put tiger is uh, the person who has a seventh house may think that the person is a cow, but the person who's looking at him or her would be like a lion, I mean tiger. This is exactly what happens. That's why they, why they, I said uh, they proved to be a good lawyers. I mean, they, they uh, argumentative. They are good at argument. They are good at uh, putting a point, etc., etc. And they don't realize that they are like that. They don't know that they are tigers. They think that they are cow. Again, same thing, similar thing like uh, 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 Gita Madam, come for coffee. <laughs> she hears us, Gita Madam, come to the coffee. <laughs> I mean, this is one tone and also sometimes you know it is words uh, switch off the light would you mind switching off the light kind of you know there are a lot of difference there are so many things people don't realize and this is a very true in case of 7th mass anybody in the 7th mass any tiger yes, doctor Uttam here I am on 7th house ah exactly I know you well <laughs> how is your clients say yeah, I think so. Yeah, seventy percent is right here. Yeah, yeah. sometimes you know you are so kind and mild. Yeah. People yeah. See, may, may see you as your business. Let us believe in it away from other land. So yeah. people yeah. yeah. out. Stay Anybody? Be better, Doctor uh, Lakshmi here. Mine is in seventh house. Oh my God! 
No, I want to understand uh, this one, uh, doctor, the fourth point, never as a frontline officer or a negotiator or marketing. What does that mean? What it means, generally when you go as a uh, the uh, the front thing, in front office means anything connected with the, uh, opening batsman, opening this thing, uh, like a uh, negotiator, if you go, okay, always a confusion. You are a bank. In other words, don't don't be as a, preferably don't be on the front. Oh, okay, okay. Be on the back bench. Be okay. all those kind of things. If you go as a, as for example, as representing some uh, uh, organization or a country, people mm -hmm. mistake you. Okay. They will see you as a tiger now. That's the problem. Oh, okay. I mean, however much you try to uh, be polite and various things, they may see you as, oh, no. I don't know. That's you should tell me any experiences happened like that any, mm -hmm. in the college days, school days, college no, days. No, not much. Okay. I don't remember anything like that. No. But mm -hmm. then maybe our Guru, Guru, Jupiter and all aspecting. That's why it has smiled down. No problem. Mm -hmm. That's it. This is one and example. That's all. One factor. The first one, misunderstanding alone means, I mean, we are misunderstood or we generally tend yes. to misunderstand others? People, people misunderstand. Okay. People misunderstand us. Okay. Means you know, you, whatever you say, they will think in some other way. Hmm. So that's the kind of a thing. Okay. Okay, doctor. You may not be aware. That's the problem. Sometimes, hmm. you know, maybe you may just say, no, I can't come. See, somebody calls you. Uh, we close. Hey, uh, Lakshmi, can you come to Korean Mall? And, uh, no, I just want to go to Zingham office. Uh, hmm. to a meeting with uh, Modi, something mm. like that, you know. Then that uh, friend will say, oh my God. Today only she has got a Modi's meeting. <laughs> something like that. Yes. Okay, okay. Mm, understood. The chances of this thing is very high. Yeah. Mm. Sir, what that, is the last point in case of female? What is the last point? Possibilities of business or martial relationship proves better only away from motherland. There's no sir, nothing as female. Sorry. No, like it is better only away from motherland. So always. So they that are... means when they go out, uh, for example, if there is a couple, example, just, and if they go away from home country, crossing the sea, then their relationship would be much better. Otherwise, no argument. Argument will be less. And a kind of harmony will be there. Whether it is business or marital relationship. You didn't get it? Okay, sir. It would be country-wise, not uh, like particular destination. No, no, like... no, no. Away from motherland. Country, country. Okay, sir. Okay, thank you. Oh, motherland. Huh? Away from motherland. Country. Mars in 8th house, Bhava, the 8th represents the core vitality, transformation, house mysteries and longevity. Luck does not favor the native's expectation, struggles more than usual, no support from brothers or family or friends, accident prone, native experiences, series of hurdles in life. This 8th house Mars, accident prone, uh, especially in the childhood, they would have seen lots of uh, falls, that, this, etc., uh, etc. Et but one good thing about them is, uh, because of their uh, kind of a struggle, kind of a, uh, aggressiveness, kind of all those things, they become a very strong people. They eventually, uh, I should write here, Eventually, they prove to be because they would have experienced lots of uh, hurdles or challenges or whatever you call 
it's not not always uh, negative thing but they become very bold and thing anybody can see in the mars it house of course they would have had a lot of time i mean injury blah 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 blah, blah. but eventually they are very strong people that's the transformation hey, anybody in the class 8 8 mars the body ninth mars in ninth house bhava the ninth represents the fortune philosophy higher education religion ethics culture traditions and father sports dance acrobatics research technical engineering leadership and politics aggressive becomes powerful than father this is very simple plain and uh, straightforward ninth mars i always tell them i external sport they are very good at sports including obama ninth mars makalagna and mars basketball player like if it is a female they would be in a dance kind of a thing anything and also mars ninth house represents technical engineering now uh, just because i said technical engineering does not mean they have to be engineers you may say oh my grandmother is this thing she doesn't uh, only fourth standard but she may be good in the kitchen with any technical problem happens even if it is modern my uh, pressure cooker she would she would know what to do example i'm just giving an example so don't ever these five points are very simple points but don't ever think as a makki ka makki translation in the sense technical engineering fine in her in her world that grandmother in her world she will be more technical she may be a small uh, problem with the door she would know how to fix it example i'm just giving an example so my point of telling is in any place any profession that technicality and engineering kind of a thing will be there that's what my point okay okay kannan yes yes no ninth house uh, sunita is ninth house oh she must be good then yeah yeah is there no the last sentence you could say becomes uh, powerful than husband <laughs> <laughs> then i should write uh, oblique husband <laughs> <laughs> okay uh yes, this thing you can write down the no worries ah uh, dance is there no this is beautiful she is a good dancer for all information sunita is a very good dancer yeah yeah which i have seen Yes, doctor. Uh, anybody else in the Mars ninth house? Yes, Mars in. Oh, sorry. Uh, somebody said something. Akshara here. Oh. Mars in ninth house. Oh, sorry, you okay. are aggressive. Very aggressive. Scared of Akshara. She is very aggressive. <laughs> <laughs> and dance when i whenever i have danced i have been good whenever i have played sports i have been good no. but obviously i have not pursued any as any career so no then you should next rotary meeting dance by akshara <laughs> no <laughs> absolutely doctor akshara get ready no yes, akshara even we haven't seen you dance in the rotary meetings So, like yeah, doctor yeah. said, we should wait for like you know good opportunity to see you. <laughs> Mars in tenth house, Bhava Dikh Bala. The tenth represents the core image in professional life, house of career, and what world sees you. Self-made person, regal status, and powerful position. Military person, adventurous and enthusiastic, revered by many, blessed with good sons, fame, and wealth. Now, Dikh Bala is a direction strength. Mars Sun in the tenth house. Generally, Mars tenth house means uh, uh, we call it military person means very disciplined. Don't have to be again. I tell the the person maybe primary school teacher. Then you may say, "Anna, what are you talking? He is only primary school teacher. He is military person." No, 
even if the person is mil uh, primary school teacher she will be disciplined very just like military military is action oriented discipline and strict strict in the sense not in the strict in the uh, uh, hiring and firing in her own way to the kids so that's it right i'm just giving example so mars tenth was like an ips officer not ias officer ips son in the 10th house ias officer uh, 10th mars ips officer i'm just giving example means person with the military uh, surgeon weapons in the authoritative position on those grounds so uh, if that primary school teacher would become a, a, a principal soon something like that heading an organization this kind of thing anybody in the 10th house mind dr geeta oh my god <laughs> no i know you should explain <laughs> yeah most of it is true doctor most of it is yeah. oh, fantastic only that that kannan also 10000 ah so naturally that's why he is a military person yeah <laughs> always carrying ak47 and yeah very strict mm, strict officer mm. exactly <laughs> dr uh, lakshmi here what yeah. is digbala means digbala means strength uh, it is one of the shadbala shadbala means uh, how to see a strength of each planet okay and Big bala here, but generally, uh, 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 when a planet position at some place, it gains the strength besides being exalted. That we will take in the class. Okay. For example, if you see this chart, you know, can you see this one here? Ah, oh, shad bala. Okay. Shad bala means six factors involving a planet to be a thing. There is a. a okay. Which determines the, the powerfulness of a planet. I mean, power, yeah, strength. Power of, of a planet. planet. There yeah. are six factors. One of the factor is big bala. So oh, okay. The big bala is a more important. For example, all combined to form this. This Venus is a strong. Okay. And Sun is strong. Mercury oh. is weak. Less oh. percent. Okay. Okay. Mm. So just like that. So okay. that's one of the thing. Okay. We will talk about that. Don't. Okay. So Mars in the tenth house. Mars, Mars in the in eleventh house, Bhava, Upachaya Sthana. The eleventh represents the house of fulfillment of desires, profits, gains, and cash flow. Divine gift of articulate and powerful speech, ability to extract work from others, strong and regal personality, loves vehicles and nature. Beautiful. Anybody in the eleventh? Ah, uh, Suchitra from Perth. Suchitra. Yes, it's uh. in the. It's actually in the in the same house. No, I didn't get it. Come again. Uh, the my lagna is Kumbal lagna. Okay. And Mars is in that. And Mars is in the same house. Then it is, is not. Right? Then. It is from lagna in the first house. Oh right. Okay. Yeah. So you you should so. tell that okay. your this Mars is in the first house. This one. Oh, okay. Okay. This is counting from Lagna, not from the zodiac signs. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Anybody else? So good. Thereby, you gradually, uh, uh, slowly, 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 you come to understand things. Even if you make a mistake, don't worry about it. So, upachaya sthana means. Ah, uh, upachaya sthana means three, six, and eleven are considered upachaya sthana. Okay. Into that later, but in short, I'll explain to you. Ah, uh, three, six, ten, eleven is considered upachaya sthana means. Ah, uh, it gives ah uh, uh, exponential growth, exponential result. With the amount of uh, work done, hard work done. Example now, Mars in the eleventh house, fulfillment of desire doesn't mean yes, you'll get the amount of practice he does. For example, if he's an Olympic runner, if he does good practice, no practice, he may get only bronze. Okay. If you go 
good practice, you'll get the silver. If you get more good practice, the more hard work, more effort, more etc. etc. All Puchasanas like that. Okay. It's an action. If it is a mercury, it is intellect. More intelligent he uses in the work. So that way. Okay. And so it enhances the the uh, what do you say? Whatever he does. The exactly. work is multiplied or work is like you no, know, like you said, exactly. Critical. Whatever yeah. work he does, so it is uh, the results will be exponential. Exponential. Especially okay. eleven thousand is a fulfillment desire. So this is what I said in the form of medals. Okay. If third house, ambition, ambition will be exponential. Example. Oh, okay, understood. Six thousand means rogarona ripu competition, competitor. Okay. It means in the uh, exponential brings to transformation kind of a thing. Example. Okay. No worry. It'll slowly, slowly will learn anyway. Okay. Doctor. Mars in 12th house, Bhava. The 12th represents the house of liberation, detachment and expenditure. Magnetic, handsome and attractive person becomes heartthrob for many. Economic drainage becomes a victim of circumstances. So, this is one. Uh, anybody in the 12th? But one. Doctor, I am in 12th. 12th. Doctor, They are very lucky. In spite of so many things. Uh, who's that? Poonam, Poonam. I mean, <laughs> that's what I said. They are be very lucky, uh, Mars in the 12th house, but they are so helpless, kind of, as the, that is exactly. Now I don't want to say, let Poonam say. <laughs> yeah, I know. I, I, I'm not able to express, but you very well know that, you know, I am lucky, but I am helpless sometimes. You know? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Puna, Uttam has seen you, then you will also tell. Okay. Uttam has seen me, but it's been a long time that we oh, okay, like, okay. interacted, so I don't the, know. <laughs> the becomes of victim of circumstances means, doesn't mean it's in a very negative. It means helpless. Mm -hmm. What she says is right. A kind of a helplessness situation. Kind of a yes. backbencher. <laughs> kind of a unable to act upon. So that is the kind of thing. See, these my words are very, very crude. Please, as mm -hmm. you see, correct yourself and uh, change as and when. So Venkat is doing also. So anybody finds uh, some better Gita Madam, when you say find better words, uh, please change it also. I, That's why I'm explaining. I, I doubt if I will, but anyway, <laughs> thank no, you. Whatever, man. You see, yes, I am very frank about it. So I don't have to uh, feel bad or anything. I know my limitations. There's nothing wrong about it. My English is very crude and saying I've just written some words. But the, basically, that's why I try to explain giving examples. Giving Doctor, examples. Doctor uh, economic yeah. drainage means yeah, economic drainage. Economic drainage yeah. means however much they try uh, to save or kind of a thing, it's somehow, you know, mm -hmm. are helpless in uh, uh, controlling uh, exactly opposite of the speculation thing. That person who is in the fifth house mm -hmm. is very lucky with all. Here, uh, helpless in the sense, oh, that uh, we have to do that one, the money goes there and this thing happened, that money goes there, kind of thing. They are mm. in their own yes. saving component, kind of a thing. So it will be like, uh, doctor, uh, how much ever you are earning, equally you are spending or you are spending more? Something like that. How much ever you are trying to save, it's not happening. Yeah. Okay. Good, good. You asked a question, please. Anybody in the 12th? Anybody other than Poonam? Uh, doctor Saranand here. Uh... Okay. My uh, mass is in 12th and it's in uh, Leo. It's in Leo. Okay. You are a Kanya Lagna person? Yeah. Oh, fantastic. Your good thing for you is third lord, eighth lord in the 12th. You got the Vipreet Raj Yoga. Minus, minus, plus kind of a thing. But uh, I'm uh, Mesha Rasi. So my Ra Rasi lord is in 12th, right? That's forget about Rasi lord. Okay. 
now just we are talking about mars only you okay. are canal uh, right yes yes so in this case it's a divine luck it is called as credit balance is punya buru punya even though there is an economic drainage suddenly bill gates comes and gives him okay chairman we want to start a new thing i'm just funding another billion dollars okay kind of. so third lord eighth lord in the 12th this is called as vibhrit raj yoga like a minus minus plus when dustana adipati dustana stays in another dustana third lord is in the 36812 or sixth lord in the 36812 eighth lord in 36812 and uh, uh, fourth lord in 36812 this is called as vibhrit raj yoga i will explain to you later but what is happening is in this uh, besides economic drainage Uh, in sort of economic drain not beside sorry sort of economic drain age he gets somewhere so, suddenly let's assume he is uh, had to pay for some this thing tax or something so 1 billion dollar suddenly 2 billion dollar comes from bill gates bill gates says okay, i want to start i want to fund your money this thing and everything so this is a luck this is the divine luck for him which i'll explain to you uh, you can that is called as vipreet raj yoga i'll vipreet raj yoga means dusta yes, yes. ready ready yeah. what happened Minus into minus plus, correct? In the mathematics, yeah. Hello? We used to say minus into minus plus, right? So this happens. The Vipri Raj Yoga means when Dustana Adipati, Dustana Adipati, in the Dustana means we have a class for that. Don't worry. I'm just writing three, six. Eight, twelve lords sitting in three, six, eight, twelve, three or six or eight or twelve. In your case, sir, your Kanya Lagna one, two, three. Lord is third lord is Mars, and eighth lord is Mars, and sitting in the twelfth house. Correct? Yeah. So that's what mm-hmm. we breathe Raj Yoga. That's why. this general term of your uh, uh, negativeness goes away that's the positive <laughs> so you would have noticed so many things unexpectedly you gain kind of a thing where it would have gone luckily somebody comes and saves or somebody uh, fills it kind of a thing this is your punyam what you call as credit balance okay but i have also lost a lot i know yeah. but you have you would have gained also Yeah, yeah. Otherwise, true. we should not have realized. True. true. Okay. Doctor Uma Shankar here. So, ah. Mars is called the Kuja. So, what is the Kuja Dosha they call? There is no Kuja Dosha, sir. Please, this oh. is very, very uh, good question you asked. People make use of that and emotional blackmail, and I have a reference for it. I have a reference in a text. First of all. Bharat Jat Kale Endirle. Then nothing is written, and uh, this Kuja Dosha, Kuja Dosha, just to tell, is a male dominant society trying to uh, bring down women's uh, daring. You know, uh, Kuja Dosha means Kuja is strong. That's all. Means Mars is powerful. Who would like to marry a Jansi Rani Lakshmi Bai? Kind of a thing. Those days, male dominant society. Oh, she's a Jansi Rani Lakshmi Bai. That's all. powerful mars means powerful so that is the way they put it to kuja dosha all those then dies husband will die kind of a thing it's not nothing to worry please delete and we have deleted in shiva and nothing no kuja dosha no negative that dosha pitur dosha all the things is no please and i have a reference to say doctor you told me to thank you doctor uh, uh. So you had told me that uh, you are like Jhansi ki Rani, right? So my husband yeah. got married to a Jhansi ki Rani, no? Yeah, but that is Jhansi ki Rani is good, good. Take the positive side, no? That's what I'm saying. I'm trying to 
validate uh, your reply. Oh, okay, okay. So that's an advantage. Uh, 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 take the advantage side thing, and people uh, misuse those things, and you know that's why they call it as kujudo shadow. So we have deleted. Thank you for asking, Uma Shankar. No, no, who's asked this question? But thank you, thank you for. Hey, sorry, I was on mute, Uma Shankar. I was the ask. Ah, Uma Shankar, hey, thanks, Uma Shankar. So everybody is clear with that, right? Kujudo shadow. There's no. He, the question asked by Uma Shankar is when one four seven ten uh, uh, when a Mars placed in that house. It forms kind of a strong Mars, and especially for matching horoscope, they say, uh, don't do this, this is bad, blah, 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 kind of a thing. So first of all, we don't match at all. I don't match at all. There's no question of matching. And it is uh, olden days necessary, not in nowadays. I'll explain to you that also. Anyway, any other questions, any doubts? Hello, Doctor. Uh, I have a question. Yeah. Uh, doctor, what is Rahu and Ketu? Because they, we are discussing other planets, but we are not discussing those planets, right? That Rahu is... Ketu comes later, Ma. Oh, okay. After Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, uh, mm -hmm. then Rahu and Ketu. But, but it, it is also part of you know the houses. It's along with other planets. But... Pardon? It, it is along with other, in case if Mars is with uh, uh, Rahu or Ketu, if any planet. Yeah, if Mars is with Rahu, he will be a passionate person when he does something. And if Mars is Ketu, Mars is with Ketu, Ketu will uh, heighten the effect. For example, if he's a warrior, he'll be the heightened warrior. If he's a gambler, heightened gambler, kind of a thing. It elevates, Ketu elevates, Rahu mm -hmm. is a passionate in that particular house. Okay. So, for example, if you say is a first house is a warrior, courageous, if mm -hmm. there, he will be passionate warrior. If it is a Ketu, he will be get an award, Ashok Chakra, or that kind of a thing. If it is the second okay. house, that way. Doctor, it's actually adding to boost to that particular planet. boost that thing, yeah. Mars in the fifth. Uh, somebody was asking something. Yes, sir. Sir, mine is mine was in Mars in third house. Uh, I have uh, with that Mercury and Sun, sir, in third house. Uh, that's okay. That's okay. fine. We'll talk in the second year. All the combination. Okay, okay. Sir. We have a class. Don't worry. Today, this this first year will be slow, steady, basic, fundamental. Then gradually, mm -hmm. we'll, and second year we'll have a combo, combo planet, then uh, three planet combo, four planet combo. Everything is there. Doctor, any uh, on this sunny, shani movement in yeah. January? Do you yeah, have yeah. any information yeah, yeah. or do, can you share sure, your sure, views sure. on that? Yeah, on November twenty four. This is now voted for in five days from now, Jupiter is becoming uh, Margi. Margi yeah. means positive direction. Lots of good things is happening for uh, Karkarashi, Vrshikarashi, etc. Uh, uh, developments for the uh, Rashi from November 24. And from January, uh, the unfinished mission from now onwards, that's what I was trying to say. From July uh, and October 24 to January, lots of unfinished mission will happen. And after January, uh, we will talk about that. As Saturn is moving, Shani Periyarchi. The Saturn is moving, going back to the Kumbha, that is this house. Okay. Uh, people with me, Rishabharashi, all those things. I'll explain. We'll take oh, yeah. one class itself. Doctor, so it means that Saturn is going on a retro, I mean, it is coming back. It has coming back, it is going forward now. It is here huh. and back to uh, Kumbha on January 2nd. 
Oh, okay. So uh, uh, the effects of that on different planets uh, that you will let us know later. 100%. Different Rashi. Different, different Rashi. Yeah. Okay. Definitely, definitely. No problem. Okay. But for uh, time being, uh, I can, uh, yeah, five minutes there, I'll straight away say something faster. Okay. Okay. Uh, who is Mesh Rashi? Anybody? Uh, I am Mesh Rashi Saranandri. Uh, sir, from 24th onwards, 24th, there can be a displacement, some kind of a transfer. Some okay. uh, uh, you are, this thing can be there, okay? It's a good thing, huh? ne not negative thing. I'm talking some kind of a thing. Okay. Uh, people will gain some uh, name, fame, and the same. I'm doing fast. And Mithun Rashi, uh, consolidation of their job, consolidation of the name, award, reward, promotion. Pat in the back. Ninth house, Karkarashi, a transfer, foreign elevation, some uh, import export project. Simarashi, uh, very divine luck. This uh, good news for them in their uh, next uh, one year. And Kanya Rashi, I'm Rashi means moon sign, okay? What I'm talking about, moon sign. Kanya Rashi people will have. Uh, good partnership deal, good elevation in the house, good news. And Tula Rashi, good business and uh, successful business, successful uh, entrepreneurial thing. And Rishik Rashi, uh, satisfaction, that's speculation, satisfaction, mind, calm. Dhu Rashi, uh, kind of house development, investment, which Peace. one, doctor? After Vishika Rashi, which one you told? Danu, Danu Rashi. Danu Rashi, okay. Danu Rashi will have a kind of a um, uh, house uh, investment and uh, uh, what you call a peace of mind. Happy. And uh, Makar Rashi people have uh, sudden unexpected travel, some ambition fulfilling, uh, some kind of a thing, good, good thing will happen. And Kumbarashi will get a lottery. Finish. That's fantastic thing. And our uh, Meen Rashi uh, uh, is the most uh, peaceful for them. And that is the realization, self realization in the Meen Rashi. And that's called as empowerment. Spiritual empowerment doesn't mean going to Shishi, Ravi Shankar, or anything. Spiritual empowerment means their Sartakate. Sartakate means. Satisfaction. Wow, I've done my this thing. My chemistry is done. Or whatever. Whatever they're saying, they become fulfilled in their own way. In the personally and professionally. So that's what it is. And Kumbarashi, again, I said Kumbarashi people, Aquarius, Moon sign, will have lots of financial gains. So this is from March, November 24. I mean, next week onwards. This is, Sir, Doctor, uh, till January, this will be there. No, no, this is for next one year. Next, As a next one year. Jupiter, okay. Jupiter in, in the thing. Uh, that is almost for six, eight months now. Okay. Sir, so for Rishabharashi, what is the thing? Sir, you didn't say Rishabharashi. I yeah. told Rishabharashi, fulfillment of desires. You will have a lot of luck, award, award, uh, recognition kind of a thing. Okay, okay. Thank you, sir. Okay. Something, uh, you know, long awaited fulfillment kind of a thing. You know, you are waiting for Nobel Prize and uh, oh my God. And suddenly they will announce, oh, uh, uh, Vengtesh will get Nobel Prize. Something like that. Nobel Prize okay. money, not just uh, prize, prize with along with money. Okay, That's sir. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Uh, it's like a Dhana Yoga, Dhana Lava. Kind of a same thing like a Rishi, uh, Kumbha Rashi, like a lottery. You'll also get lottery along with the name and fame. Okay, sir. So that kind thank, of thing. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Sir. In, in, uh, in your case, it could be some... Uh, uh, rotary fund, rotary getting from New Zealand, you may get some or Germany, you get the rotary funding and with the name, good award, secretary of rotary, blah, blah, blah. That kind of thing. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Okay. Don't sir, call me sir, sir, sir. Bala. I'm just Bala. No, <laughs> sir. <laughs> Dr. Mithun Rashi, you said consolidation of what, doctor? Consolidation of the job, consolidation of your work, consolidation of your uh, 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 tune to the world, whatever you are, whatever you plan to do. Consolidation means 
For example, if somebody is in a temporary, you will get a permanent job. I mean, mm -hmm. permanent. If you what you are doing, for example, you are writing a book, novel, and the novel mm -hmm. will be published and it will get uh, circulated. Mm -hmm. And crude examples. Huh? Anything, whatever you are, your professional life will mm -hmm. be more consolidated, strong. Okay. Okay. Uh, award reward kind of a thing. Okay, that's... Image, image building up, you can say. Oh. It will be shown to the world. Oh, she's a good writer kind of a thing. Okay. If you're just a bank officer, you'll get a thing, oh, promotion or consolidate or blah, 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 something like that. Okay. This six, eight months, exactly, from November 24, you can, globally, it will have a good change also. You will mm. Doctor, please, can you repeat for the Sagittarius? Sagittarius, anything connected with the house and uh, a new house, new car, new vehicle, a mother's health improves, kind of a thing, or anything connected with Sukhasthana, anything connected with the pleasure, you are not pleasure, uh, anything connected with your satisfaction of the house, relaxation. That means uh, you may do interior painting or you may do no new house or maybe new car, you may uh, get kind of a uh, satisfaction, peace of mind. That's one of the best things to have peace of mind. You okay. is at home. Earlier, it was a war, Kurukshetra war going on. Suddenly you say, oh, wow, everything comes to peace, that kind of thing. One of the nice things to happen. More of a wisdom. Okay. Realization. Thank you. God bless you, ma. God bless you all. Thank you, doctor. It will be on my 8 o'clock over. I don't want to take time. Thank you. Thank you, doctor. Thank you, doctor. Thank, Thank you. you. Doctor. Thanks a lot. Have a nice day. Thanks a lot. Next Thanks week. A lot. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And by the way, today, uh, today, batch 12 is starting. Uh, wish them all batch 12. Doctor, doctor I sent you my friend's uh, thing. I don't know whether you saw it. Uh, I, she's yeah. been added also. Okay, great. Already, Thank you. Already. Okay. Thank you, doctor. Thank you. What time is it? It's 3.30 uh, p.m. India time. Okay. Saturday. Thank you, doctor. Venkat Thank is you, taking. Doctor. Beautiful. He's a good teacher. Okay. Thank you, all the best to all new batch people and yeah. the teacher. Thank, Thank you. you, doctor. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks, Thanks. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you, doctor. Thank you, ma. Thank you, doctor. Thank you. Thank you, Angel.